Asha. Hi, baby. This little thing, tiny, great, scared girl, is Asha. Asha was um, trapped on the streets of Canarsie by a young woman who has brought us several cats over the last few years. Um, she said she was particularly fond of this little one because she lived through the winter where so many disappeared. She thinks that you're going to kill her. Oh, baby girl. And then she realizes you're not. Um, the young woman that brought her to me, who fed her through the winter, was allowed to pet her. I'm allowed to pet her when she's eating. She's only been here for two days. Um, and I have a lot of kitties to take care of, so she should leave as soon as possible and go live with somebody with patience and love for her. Um, Asha means hope in Sanskrit and life in Swahili, or else I've got that wrong and it's the other way around. Um, and in the Persian language, it's said that people named Asha uh, very much want love and connection with other people and want to create peace and harmony. So this lovely lady needs somebody with the patience to have help her live up to her name. Yes, my love, it's okay, Buns. It's okay, Ash. It's okay, Ash. You good girl. It's okay, honey. Nobody's ever going to hurt you again. What happens is when cats have been raised up by someone and are tame, and then get dumped on the street. If they spend an awful long time out there, um, when you touch them, it's sort of like an electric shock, um, and they are expecting the absolute worst. Come here, Ash. Oh, I don't know about your movie. We'll continue this. We'll do a part two in a second. I'm going to show you being petted. And she even lets me pick her up. It's just she's really going to need somebody to teach her the world is safe. Um, she's very young and has a long life ahead of her. She's about a year and a half old.